Hey YouTube! <laughs> wow. Okay. So I just got done styling my hair because I got this idea. I don't know who gave me the idea because it's so weird for me because I usually don't want to put my hair in a half up because I'm kind of afraid of showing my sideburns or the side hairs that are in my over here, you know, it's like right there. But apparently that's what I'm supposed to do, it's just like... So yeah, so I just, uh... Oh! These are my earrings. They're, uh... Really cool. Really beautiful. And this guy right here. Oh, I have a pendant on my chest right here because apparently it wanted me to put it on there. So, um, I don't really know what's going on with that. Um, so I just put it there. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, dealing with a lot of stuff. Um, finding out yesterday that, uh, actually not yesterday, today, um, I started my period. <laughs> So, brain you'd see was the best. And now I'm not working with Freya anymore because she tricked me. And uh, basically it's working, uh, was basically I thought at the first um, helping me. I was going to give me the baby and I was going to feel all the stuff. Well, the truth is, I did feel all the stuff that went with the pregnancy symptoms and whatnot, but turned out that it wasn't pregnancy. It was actually just me feeling my period coming on because I had ovulated and not done anything on time like I was supposed to. So yeah, I kind of just, you know, work with it, I guess. So yeah, it's been a long day. Um, things got done today that, uh, <laughs> uh, things got done yesterday mostly, but um, today we uh, went to my doctor's appointment like we were supposed to. Uh, I did the pregnancy test at the doctor's office and they told me that the pregnancy test that was positive was actually just telling me that I was ovulating. So, the day that I took it, which was the 26th, oh, I had already ovulated. Which is pretty shitty. <laughs> so I guess um, a lot of things are getting done now to change a lot of things. Um, we have uh, been, we're planning on forcing this pregnancy thing because I decided Freya and I were not going to communicate anymore. And I told Freya myself today, I am not communicating with her anymore. She will no longer be one of my patrons. So she is officially on my bad side. You don't trick me. My mom is pretty pissed. Literally pissed that Freya tricked me. Of course, then again. I am only 22, and I'm still kind of like as naive as a 16-year-old, so... <sighs> but now that I've learned my lesson, I know who I really can depend on for everything that I need. Yashua and Mommy. Uh-oh! Uh, <laughs> I'm starting to call Diana mother now. Um, by the way, I found out something about my servitor. I have not been talking about my servitor on here at all, have I? 
So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to talk to you guys mostly about my servitor. And I want to show you my servitor. And um, the this <laughs> it looks like a kind of warped face. <laughs> How did your face get warped like that? So yeah, a little warped uh, over the over the days of trying to uh, <laughs> keep things from happening. But um, if you look got her from the way she used to look. The original way she looked was so darn cute I couldn't help it. Can't do anything to change it, but that would be the foxy I uh, named Artemis. Um, actually Artemis kind of gave himself the name. This is a he. <laughs> Say hi, Artemis. Artemis is a little fascinated, I think. What? It's a camera. We're on camera. We're being recorded. This is a video. Yeah, you just want to stare me down. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, this is Artemis. Um, I have decided that I will use only one pendulum from now on and uh, communicate with everybody through that same pendulum. So um, I have decided that I'm going to take the neck piece that is around Artemis and add the amethyst to it after I am done washing it in water. So this is what I'm going to do. I am going to show you guys exactly what I want to do. Um, first off, I need some water. This would be it. Yeah, let's go. Cool. So I'm um, going to take this water and um, basically cleanse everything with it. So um, give me a moment, I'm going to pause this video and going to move on to the next room. Okay, we've got our ritual items here. Um, it's not a ritual ritual, but it's kind of like a sort of a ritual type thing, but, um, getting that out of the way. This here needs to be cleansed out real quick because it's got some old things in it that don't need to be there. Plus I need to have this here. This needs to There's the brown candle. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, so this is how I'm going to do this because I figured this would be a good idea. To first cleanse this by pouring that in there and um, going to use my athame to help me do this because I figured it wouldn't hurt to have my athame involved in this. And yes folks, I'm showing you guys how I bring out my athame. We need to straighten up. Thank you. There we go. That's how you do it. Just like that. Now, going to simply yes, there is salt in here. I'm getting out all of the excess stuff in here as well. This is more of a cleansing type thing that I'm doing. 
So what I'm going to do while I'm doing this is light this white candle here. This uh, kind of a double scented candle. Got two different colors to it. But I don't think that's really a bad thing. Let's just I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna move you over here, okay? That would be the candle, the fire that, the flame that you guys are seeing. I think you guys can see the flame, right? Can you guys see the flame? For some reason, it doesn't want you guys to see the flame. There's a the flame. Fire! What the big fire! Let it be flame. Oh. <laughs> So yeah, if it wants to rise up and let you guys see it, you guys will see it. Okay, first off we're going to do this thing called the burn. And that's the athame, because we're kind of activating the athame a little bit here. Okay. Can we take it? Around. And simply placing this over top of this. This is going to be taken over here. Fire really wants to be seen today. Now we're going to pour some more water in here. We're going to repeat the same process until it is completely clean. Thank <laughs> you. 
Lan kan Resulting with Pal <laughs> Now we're going to place this and here and give it a water bath This is going to be in the water bath overnight. For now though, we're going to also give this a water bath. What are you doing leaning towards Artemis? Ah, I'm supposed to put you out, aren't I? And there goes the smoke from that. May purity, love, and peace go up into the atmosphere and create love, purity, and peace. Love, purity, and peace. Love, purity, and peace. Alright. Going to add this in there as well. So this is how it's come to be. I guess it's um, a little different. Okay, so I gotta fix some things here. So it's been 18 minutes, and you guys just watched me do something completely 100% boring. <laughs> Sorry. Um, that's actually not something I should be sorry for. <laughs> I did this video for entertainment purposes and also for the purpose of, sorry, sucking in gut. Fat. Yeah. Okay, um, let's see here. That water is cleaning that. Showing you guys how that happens, so I think that I am good with all that's going on. Oh, by the way, uh, there's going to be a uh, song at the beginning of this video that um, is going to go completely with my theme of uh, Wicca, Pagan, Paganism and everything. Um, it is um, supposed, it's a song that is uh, I don't know who it's written by exactly, but it's a song I found on YouTube. That's right, folks. YouTube. So I will see you guys in my next video, which is going to be um, also recorded today, but posted um, later on tonight. 
uh, later on today while I am over at McDonald's because I'm also going to record it while I'm over at McDonald's which is like literally across the street from us <laughs> this facility that we're staying in right now is actually going to be taken over by somebody else so yeah things are gonna be getting pretty interesting so see you guys later have a great day don't do anything stupid and well you guys know what to do doses